Hello everyone, happy Monday, how are you? It is Real and Raw at Four with Rebecca Adams at rebeccaadamsbiz.com. I hope you've had an outstanding and incredible weekend. Let me know whether you're watching live or whether you're watching it on the replay, that would be amazing so that I can get all of the, um, you know, all of the, all of you. And I can actually, hi Carrie, how are the horses? How's Vicky? Um, so yeah, let me know whether you're watching live or on the replay so I can actually comment back to you and reply to your comments and everything else. So let me know how your weekend's gone. Don't know about you, but in the UK where I am, which is not far from Bath, we've got glorious weather right now. So let me know, Carrie, how the horses are handling the hot weather. Is it better than you know? That would be amazing. And I am straight out the gate. Hello, Alison. I'm going to open my door because it says the signal is a bit crazy. So let me know whether it is or not and then I will sort that out so hopefully it's fine from there so today we're on about alignment today we're on about high frequency and today we're also about talking about meaning mean business so what I mean by that is that you mean business when you when you're doing your stuff and everything so what I'm going to do I'm going to go down I'm going to invite lots of people if you want to do that as well that would be incredible and amazing and let me know where you're watching from as well because some of you live in one particular place but you might be watching me live somewhere else you might be in someone else's place you might be in a different town you may be at an event you may be in a different city or in a coffee shop or something rather than being at home so let me know where you're watching from Hello, Alison. Hello, Aneska. Hope you're okay. Thank you so much. Let me know if this signal's okay, guys, because it seems to be up and down yet again. Hi, Charlotte. Hi, Alison. Let me know about the signal, guys. So today I'm going to go straight into it just in case we get cut off again. So I'm talking about alignment. So what does alignment mean to you? Let me know in the comments. Alignment means to me doing stuff in alignment with how I feel. I wear my heart on my sleeve. I'm all about people my work, making sure that all of my work is in alignment with the grand old scheme of things in the way. So the, the bigger picture, it is all about helping people. What's the end game? That's what I'm focused on and make sure that I'm in alignment with that. Not making sure, not, not having an ego, not making, you know, making it that I'm better than anyone else, you know, stuff like that. Hi Gemma. Let me know about the signal because the signal is messing up again. South Africa is here and I'm home. Fantastic. Hi, Lorna. Have you got lovely weather as well? Let me know what your weather's like, guys. Wherever you are, let me know what, about your weather. So alignment to me. So let me know what alignment means to you. To me, it is like staying humble, staying focused, keeping my feet on the ground and everything. Alison says, feel calm inside. Things feel right and things flow. Yeah. Things flow like a river. Everything is in alignment. Everything feels good. Everything's great. There's no stress. Gemma says weather's amazing. I love it. I love it. Hello, Sharon. How are you? Sending you lots of love. Mm -hmm. Feel authentic and honest. Yes. We're talking about, if you've just joined, we're talking about alignment. What does alignment mean to you? To me, it means staying humble. To me, it means staying focused on the end game, what the end result is, making sure that sun is shining in Scotland, weather's amazing in Stroud. Aneska says it's getting cold, so you're happy. Aneska's in South Africa and she says it's getting cold. Gemma says I feel happy today making a list, feel, feeling things are coming together. Exactly, it's all in alignment. Alignment means not being stressed, right? Alignment means that everything is working out the way it's supposed to. Trust in the universe, knowing that everything is working out in your favour. It is absolutely fantastic and it feels great, right? How do you feel? Comment one word below and let me know how you feel when things are in alignment for you. Let me know while I take a drink. Aneska says to me, I feel like it's right I'm in the right place, I'm doing the right thing, fantastic. And it is all about making sure it's about you because it's your feelings, right? Let me know. Let me know, let me know if the signal's fine. Um, shamazing, shamazing. So it's all about making sure that everything's in alignment with you, whether it, whether you've got clients, whether you've got customers, how you feel in your relationship, with your mindset, everything, making sure it's in alignment with that. I'm back, I'm back. 
Um, Aneska says, um, I feel amazing because I know I'm in the right place. Exactly. And you're looked after as well. Hello, Natasha. Can everyone say hi to Ignite? Natasha, she is our amazing photographer. I want to message you. I'm going to message you. It's absolutely fantastic. Which leads me on to high frequency. So, Alison just says that she feels amazing. I'm going to pause. So every time it comes up orange at the top of my screen, I'm going to pause till it goes green. Can't stop smiling. Fantastic, Ineska. I love it. That's exactly what it is. And when you are aligned, you're on high frequency. On my break at Tesco. Enjoy Tesco, Natasha. So it is all about you feeling good, staying in the high vibration frequency, making sure that you are, you know, getting what you want you are really focused on your desire and you feel great and amazing and focused. It's gone orange again. It is a match to you. So however you want to feel to how you are feeling has to match up and be in alignment for you to stay in the high frequency. So you feel great. The ripple effect is that, you know, your aura is going out there. You'll attract more goodness and more great clients and customers and you just feel good because when you feel good you smile you're nicer to people and the ripple effect is massive and like Aneska said she's on a high but now in that way not in that way no I know what you mean I know what you mean Sharon says feel so alive this week while we're taking negativity away <laughs> how good do you feel when all of that toxicity is gone when all of the negatives gone how do you feel it really is fantastic right so the final thing I want to chat about is mean business. Now, what I mean by that is for you going for it. You mean business in what you do, in everything that is in alignment with you when you're on the high frequency. It means that you mean business as you mean to go along. It doesn't mean that you are mean, online, offline, whatever, okay? Amazing. Sharon, I love it. I absolutely love it. So what it means is that you mean business. You don't faff about it business. You go all in. You go all in 100%. You don't mess about and keep looking above for the orange thing. I. You go all in. <laughs> Keeps going on. You got nothing to lose and everything to gain. We do keep going always, right, guys? Keep going always. So you've got nothing to lose and everything to gain. And the thing is, you're not mean in business. Customers, clients are gold. It means you build relationships up. You don't, you know, be nasty online, offline. If people want to leave the business, if people don't want to buy from you anymore, that's okay. That's their prerogative. But you don't have to be nasty about it. You don't have to be mean in business, but you do. Aneska says she's on a high, but not in that way, just joking. Aneska says keep going always, always, always. So it is all about you mean in business, going all in, putting 100% in, treating your customers and clients and friends and contacts like gold, because they are, and not being mean or nasty. Because then the ripple effect is that, you know, bad feedback travels just as fast as good, if not faster, okay? So just know that when you go all in, you're on the high frequency, you mean business, and you're in alignment, everything works out just for you. Thousand percent in, definitely, definitely. So really, really think about what you want to feel. Think about, we do keep going always, we, we, Alison, we do, we do, we do. I keep pausing with the orange at the top, there's nothing I can do, guys. Sharon said she's all in, fantastic. So really think about your alignment, how you wanna feel. So on the high frequency, when you feel good, you wanna keep more of that, right? And then you mean business when you go all in 100% and you're building relationships. You don't have to be mean, you don't have to be nasty in business, you don't have to get aggressive, don't have to be in people's PM boxes or emails and shout and scream down the phone, that is so unprofessional, it's unreal. Hello Cheryl, hope you're okay. Um, Aneska says I wanna be happy, and I wanna feel happy and of course, that is exactly what life is about. You want to be happy, feel happy, hey, feel happy, be happy and be in love with your life because that is what life is. Life's a journey. Life is so precious and life is a journey and you're worth more than rubies and diamonds, right? You are irreplaceable and you are absolutely outstanding at what you do. So it's all about loving life, being in alignment, doing what you want to do and um, setting the bar up there but also meaning going all in meaning business going all in 100% with everything that you do. Now at the moment we've got tech issues, obviously, 
um, stuff is going on locally with the Wi-Fi. Comment below if you've got any questions about anything at all. I mean, today we talk about alignment. Today we talk about you being in alignment for the end result, what you want for yourself, your clients, your customers and everything. Also think about the high frequency that you want to keep it. You want to feel good. You want to better yourself. You want to better your business and everything. And then also mean business. Not being mean in business, but mean in business. Mean Alison says, shine bright like diamonds. You are definitely. So let me know if you've got anything, any question at all that I can help you with right now regarding life, business, relationships, mindset, anything at all. And I will answer you live right now with the tech issues or not. I will answer you live right now. If you are kind of in a funk and you're feeling funky and icky about something, maybe a client's come to you and they don't want to re-sign up to you, maybe someone said that your, your, hi Sarah, that your products or services are too much money, hi Mandy, um, really, really think about it, so let me know below, you can ask me anything, poor connection, oh my dear, um, I've been in business 16 years, so... <laughs> Just go with the flow of everything. Someone mentioned flow before. Just go with the flow of everything, right? So with tech issues and without tech issues, whatever. Sharon says, can someone recommend any mindset books? Mindset, mindset, mindset. So definitely, I am looking at them right now. It depends what sort of mindset, what sort of mindset you're on about. Hi, Mandy. What sort of mindset you're on about? I would definitely recommend Outwitting the Devil by Napoleon Hill. Um, Sharon... Sharon says you think you've worn YouTube out. So good book. I don't know whether it's on audio, but it's called Outwitting the Devil. And you don't have to read all the beginning if you want to. You can go straight to the questions and answers. Basically, um, it starts on page 58. And basically, the devil is the negative in the world. Okay, so it's negative versus positive and how we tend to are programmed in society, which is why I which is why I say unplug a little bit like the matrix so the negative out in the world society brainwashing and all of that like all the news and all the negative and all that is to keep you in a sense of lack in a sense of fear and everything else and you know when you unplug from all of that this is the book so from page 58 onwards you don't have to read the beginning if you don't want to and um, go straight in it talks about a lot of topics and it's called outwitting the devil napoleon hill Obviously, you've got a lot going on. So you've got um, mindset. You've got um, lots and lots of different books that you can read. Um, ones like, um, you know, mindset books. You can have finding the balance of things that you can do. Mindfulness books help. The Universe Has Your Back by Gabrielle Bernstein. That's a really good book. If you talk about law of attraction mindset type thing, you're talking Rhonda Boone's books, which are absolutely fantastic right now mindset 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 it depends what kind of mindset you're on about you're welcome depends what type of mindset you're on about and um, if you're talking business if you're talking life if you're talking money there's all different types of mindset books out there but that is definitely one i'd recommend definitely um there's probably another one that i've got here um See, I've got money mindset books as well, which are separate to the rest of them. So it does depend what you're what you're thinking about. But yeah, go on Amazon, go and pick one that I would definitely recommend. Is let me grab it out. Is mindset is in really really disconnecting from a lot of people. Is codependent no more by Melody Beatty. Something that I recommend to a lot of people. And um, basically, it's cutting the apron strings on things. You know what I mean on things and people and and stuff like that. So that's another good one too. So it depends what type you're after, but um, they're all amazing. Um, lifting. I'm a Les Brown fan too. Yes. We like Les Brown. I like uh, Will Smith. Will Smith is absolutely fantastic. And he actually um, recommended, let me grab it behind here. This is one book I definitely recommend to all of you. Let me move my finger there. Is this one. The Alchemist. Okay, this was recommended by Will Smith. So, The Alchemist, definitely, definitely recommend this book. It is absolutely fantastic. Great, gets you remembering to be focused 
on the present moment, shall we say. It's absolutely outstanding. So that is definitely one I would recommend. Absolutely love that book. It is, it is a really, really good book, isn't it? Let me turn you that way. So yeah, it really is fantastic. So what, anyone watching right now, I'm repeating because it went orange. Anyone watching right now, if you've got a good book that you'd like to recommend to Sharon, that would be incredible. So you love that book. It is, it is The Alchemist. It's brilliant. My daughter loves it too. Fantastic. I love it. Absolutely love it. So really, really think about what type of mindset shift that you're on about and then hone in on that. So if you're on about money, if you're on about law of attraction mindset, if you're on about, you know, life, if you're on about business, think of the different aspects of things and then go from there, Sharon, definitely. But it really is, it's all going to help, isn't it? So I can't cope with this this thing keep going orange and green. I don't even understand. Mm. Anyway, I'm going to wrap up because it just keeps going off. So hopefully on Friday, it's not going to be like this. So we talk about alignment. So make sure that everything is in alignment with you. Don't feel as though you have to do something because someone else tells you you have to. Make sure it's in alignment with you, okay? Make sure it, it's follow your gut. Make sure it's in alignment with how you feel, how you'd want to be treated and everything else. When you find, hi Vicky, when you find when you find the high frequency of things, really hone in on that. Notice your emotions, see what feels good to you and see what's showing up for you and then go from there and stay in that high positive vibrational match. That is where you want to be. That's where you want to remain. That's where you want to be. But that doesn't mean that, you know, negative things can show up. It's how you deal with it. And then the final thing was mean business. That doesn't mean to be mean in business at all, don't be nasty to people, but it means when you when you go into business or you're doing your work or your relationships, your mindset, whatever, go all in 100% and then really, really, you know, go for it. You've got nothing to lose and everything to gain. So have an incredible Monday evening, whatever you're doing. I am going to go because the internet keeps faffing about. <laughs> it's doing it again. Seriously, I can breathe and we'll do the positive thing. So um, just know that you are enough, you are worthy, you are incredible. And know that Ignite 2020 early bird tickets are available right now. So get your Ignite tickets straight away, payment plan as well. I will put the link below. You don't want to miss out. This year is absolutely phenomenal. Got my coaster made by Lauren Lindsay. Amazing. Oh! She's just popped up. Hello, Lauren. Hello, Gracie. Can everyone send Gracie's nephews lots and lots of love, please, and lots of health? But these were made by um, Lauren Lindsay. So, Lauren, you just popped up just in time, honey. The internet keeps going off and all, so I'm going to go in a minute. So, it is absolutely fantastic and it is all about empowerment. So, it's all about the alignment of things. It's all about the high frequency and staying there. And it's all about me in business. Honestly, this internet, I can't cope. <sighs> deep breath so yeah <laughs> it is you can't sort out tech issues can you hello emma oh fantastic honestly it does test you it does it does so stay in alignment stay on the high frequency of things when you get there make sure that you feel great it's not icky and stuff and then mean business so go all in. Don't be mean in business, but mean business, go all in when you get there. So Ignite Live event, May 2020. This internet. You will find out shortly every detail that's going to be happening. I'm really, really excited. So stay watching. I'll put the link below. Payment plans are available. So really excited. It's all about empowerment and it's all about you. Every single person that went to Ignite actually changed um 98% change for the better absolutely fantastic I love it and we really move mountains at that event and it's changed people's lives I'm really really blessed and honored so thank you so much for watching even with the tech issues today know that you can and will achieve anything you set your mind to keep going always and I will see you Friday real and raw at four watch this space if you're on my VIP list you will be getting emails this week something exciting is coming so I will speak to you soon